So we're here in Spice's Music in Auburn, Alabama. We're in the acoustic room, the beautiful acoustic room. This room is fantastic for our first edition of Spicer's Live. We've got Josh Jackson from Make Sure. Um, Josh, thank you for coming and for humoring us and for doing this, for putting on a performance of a brand new song that is not even out yet. Yes. Tell us about the song. The song is called Wildflower Bed, and it's on the new album called June that will be coming out in uh, on April 12th, 2024. Yeah, fantastic. So you just finished recording this album. You kind of got everything wrapped up. When you were thinking about doing this song acoustically, I guess the song is an acoustic. I haven't heard the song it on the is. record. It is. The it's, song is acoustic on the yes. record. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Uh, on the record, it's, it's 12 strings and a bunch of other stuff. What kind of other stuff? That's why. That's what the people want to know. Ah, uh, yes. So, um, so yeah, it's. Well, first of all, I'll talk about the twelve string. So I, I play just a normal six string, uh, Seagull, uh, Mosaic EQ, I believe, mm-hmm. on, on this on this beautiful uh, guitar. Yeah, it's beautiful, beautiful guitar, and uh, sounds really, really great. Uh, on the record, however, um, we use twelve strings. I really wanted to sound like Big Star's number one record. Um, and there's a bunch of 12 string on that. Um, and there's a certain style to that where it's like you, you, you recorded the 12 string and they also just, uh, I, we ran it through tape and just compressed the, you know, cheese out of it. And that's the sound. Um, mm-hmm. and so, uh, that, you know, it's really, I don't know, airy kind of twinkly, whatever. 12 strings also, they record kind of strange. Um, they don't have as much body or low end as a, a typical six string would. 
Um, and so we could sort of, it was an interesting song to mix because mm -hmm. there's all these like fluttering 12 string things going on. But to fill in the low end, we had, you know, the electric bass. And then also there's some, some Tom work on the drums and we kept a lot of that kind of beefiness to it. Yeah. Um, to, you know, hopefully round everything out. Um, other than that, some other things you might hear there, and I brought some, some, you good, got a bag of tricks here. Some What's goodies to show. Um, so the first thing you hear is a, is an organ sort of pad that drones throughout pretty much the whole song. And, um, the two things that I ran that through was the Walrus Audio Polychrome Flanger. Um, I love some flanger. So I wanted it, I like the, the, the movement that yeah, the movement modulation the flanger, will add. Yeah, sure. uh, and so it's, it's just this constant drone throughout the whole song. But uh, flanger sort of, I, I know the way that the, the it's it's like two tape heads like going out of sync or something and of course this is just a digital version of that but I ran it through then from that to this which is a Behringer digital multi effects with a stereo out okay. which is great so now what you get is and you recorded it in stereo yeah that, what yes specifically yeah so uh, you can run stuff through that and then uh, you, you go out stereo and it sort of creates this, you know, drifting back and forth modulation. Yeah, so that. some people might do that, quote, in the box where they're yeah. actually panning it back and forth, but with this pedal, it does that without you having yeah. to do that. Yeah, also panning. some people would just use a plug-in, but I didn't want to do that. <laughs> I wanted to run it through uh, pedals. I've, I've, and the guys I recorded with, Jimmy Smith and Michael Mankoff, whom you've met. Yeah. Also, Rob plays drums on the album and does a fantastic job. Um, um, it, on at least two songs, and you, you'll hard to miss because they're it's really cool parts. Um, but uh, those guys, the engineers, um, we are so geeky about outboard gear that it's like yeah. any opportunity I could get to use some sort of outboard thing, I, w I wanted to do that. Yeah, maybe do you like the organicness of it? Yes, yes. I think twisting it, the knobs and pushing the buttons. Yes, sort of because yeah. here's what you can do here's a little thing as it's going through the record, you can change the rate. And yes, you could do that through automation, but it's not as fun. Um, well, because you're playing it. That's right. You're playing it that's in right. real time. You're actually yeah. um, using that like an instrument. Yeah, yeah, so that's way more fun. Yeah, sending something out and then putting it back in uh, after it's gone through all the pedals. I haven't even heard this song, and I'm so excited. I can't wait to hear the album yeah. out April 12th. April 12th, that right? that's correct. And it's called June. Yes. Yeah. Josh Jackson from Make Sure, getting a little bit nerdy with us. It's yep. exactly what we wanted to hear. Thanks for playing the song. It's fantastic. We're glad you came. Thanks, man.